of mine from uh, the Sage Tuition Rewards Program, Robert uh, Savet, who is their chief uh, operating officer. Um, just a, a few things I, I want to mention before diving in here. I'll give you a 100-foot uh, overview, as I always do, and, uh, and then we'll, we'll start the slides, and then uh, about five to ten minutes in, I'll introduce Robert, and then uh, he'll, he will take controls and go over the feature presentation. Okay, so just a, a few things. Um, we're going to share a few statistics with you. I'm going to show you some of our value add and, and why you should be utilizing uh, the SAGE scholarship uh, platform. Um, and then, of course, uh, we're going to point out a few facts, uh, new marketing material, things that you can do to start driving business uh, as soon as you're set up in the program. Okay, so first of all, um, there's no uh, gray area here. We don't uh, charge for the program. As long as you're a Levinson active agent, okay, then this is fully complimentary to you. There's no commission reduction. Um, you're not forced into a corner by only selling very expensive products and then including the platform. It doesn't work like that. Um, in fact, our carriers and products that are in the program are very competitive uh, household names. Uh, you'll see in a few more minutes. Um, so there's really no uh, gray area or small print here, okay? This is a value add by working with Levinson and Associates, okay? We'll go over a, a few items here before we get started. Bottom right corner there, that's actually a, a picture of me wearing a, a polo shirt. That is a, a custom mag magnetic pins that we have made up. Um, it simply says, ask me about free scholarships. And, you know, it's a very simple black and white concept, but this idea draws tons of conversations and questions. Okay, we have agents that wear these pins now. They're in a, a supermarket and they wear these pins every day and someone will come up to them and say hey you know tell me i have a a, a kid that's uh, just started high school or middle school and you know we're already talking about colleges and tell me about this uh, free scholarship and that's how you get into a life insurance sale okay we all know it begins with a conversation that's how the door is opened and ultimately a sale is made in this case a win-win you're helping out a family right in case of a, a death of the breadwinner and and B you're helping with a college education for little Johnny or Susie so it really is a win-win-win um, these are free okay so we're giving these out to everybody that is at our expo next Friday um, if you're not attending Air Expo and you're on this call today, uh, as long as you're active with one qualifying carrier, we'll send this out for free. Um, just let us know after the call. You can shoot me an email, um, bill at carrylevinson.com, and I'll make sure I get this mailed out to you. Okay, so moving forward here, I want to talk about some of the latest statistics that are just in from LIMRA and lifehappens.org. Okay, so these are all facts in the insurance industry for 2018. So real quick, you know, we're, we're always talking about, you know, websites and uh, social media integration and marketing online by using agency automator and generating leads with all of our custom marketing material. You know, it's it, it's a, you probably heard this literally hundreds and hundreds of times, okay? And after a while, you know, you say to yourself, well, Bill, this sounds great, but, you know, how do I get started? And, you know, does it really work? And the answer to that question is absolutely freaking lutely it works, okay? And he, these are some of the, the facts and, and stats in front of you. 2018 insurance barometer studies show social media is a key factor in evaluating agents and advisors. So just real quick, the percentage of clients who ask for recommendations through social media when looking for an agent or advisor, millennials made up for more than 50%, even Gen Xers at 44%, okay? That tells us that we have to be out there, okay, at least at the minimum on Facebook uh, or Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, you have to have a, a page that looks professional and we can help you uh, with all of this. We even have a quoting engine that is built into your Facebook page. So some really cool stuff here. In the middle section, over 66% of consumers would not do business with an advisor who has an out-of-date website. 
okay? That is huge, okay? And if you notice, there's no age range there, okay? There's no brackets. That is everybody that was surveyed, over 66% of those consumers would not do business with an advisor with a website that's out of date okay that's huge that's exactly the reason why we're rolling out the brand new free website platform which you'll see at our expo and then of course after the expo you can sign up that's going to take over uh, the old platform but this shows us we need to be online you know you think back 70s and 80s you know you had to have a brick and mortar storefront agency that looked great with a nice sign and you know professional looking wallpaper you had to come to work in a suit and tie to put on a good presentation well those days are over now okay take that same approach but that's your online website and social media pages that's the new brick and mortar so just keep that in the back of your mind okay when marketing and and moving forward and leveraging some of the great tools and technology that we offer okay the bottom paragraph there most clients now this is also important because you know you hear about this uh, d2c which is direct to consumer sales some of the life insurance companies have tried this by selling straight to the consumer without an agent okay that doesn't work and even in the near future as the proof is in these stats that still doesn't work so this tells all of us that our careers and jobs are safe most clients still want to meet with a financial professional before purchasing, including millennials, at 73%, highest percentage of all generations. That tells me in a nutshell that these consumers out there, yes, they're going to search online. Yes, they're going to check out your website and social media, but they still want to talk to someone live. That I love that statistic. On the bottom, 87% of consumers say they would use the internet to research life insurance during the purchasing process. That's almost everybody they surveyed, okay, said that they're going to go online to do some research before pulling the trigger. Again, once again, that's telling us make sure you have an online presence. So important there, and that's exactly why we do what we do with the iGenius platform. Okay, so real quick, uh, some of the new infographics. We simplified everything. We made your life a lot easier. Last year, we sent out a survey, and a lot of pushback uh, we heard from agents was, you know, Bill, we love everything you guys are doing, but it's overwhelming. We don't know where to start. We don't know where to end. We don't know where the middle is. Tell, tell us more about this SAGE scholarship program, okay? We don't know enough about it, so we simplified everything. We put together these three easy to use. They're literally one click away. We have a marketing tab on the left, contracting middle, new business right. If you click on the graphic, they're called an in, in infographic, okay? Everything is in front of you, numbered and itemized, okay? In the marketing side, it goes all the way up by 50, and everything says, uh, let's say, number two, scholarship program, gives you all the details, and then a button for uh, click more to receive info. So everything black and white. Contracting, you don't know where to start. Uh, maybe you want to learn about our new E&O policy that we just rolled out, 395 bucks for a million dollars of coverage. Um, again, everything is at your fingertips. Contracting, commissions, advances. On the right side, we have new business. Uh, let's say you don't know about exams. What simplified issue? Who orders an APS? Where, how do I know a case is approved, right? Or maybe you want to see what your downline is doing if they're writing business. So long story short, the right side is the new business infographic. Everything you need to know about new business is on the right side. So these are going to be launched this week. The marketing tab is already launched, but you can send these to any downline agents. If you want to brush up on all of the value add that Levinson brings to the table, just click on the marketing tab. Everything is in front of you, simplifies your world for 2018. Okay, Joe, moving forward, we're going to talk about some of our scholarship marketing material that we have put together here at Levinson. Now, it's very important to know, okay, this, this program is is really a, a no-brainer win-win but you know with that said it does 
have to be marketed the right way, okay? Um, we can't break any rules here, okay? We encourage you to use our marketing material um, that's already been SAGE approved, um, or if you wanna build a custom piece, please send it to us first. We will make sure it's compliant with SAGE, uh, and then we will get that piece back to you and you can start marketing the program. But it's very important to know that. So we have a bunch of material, um, websites, everything is at your fingertips, okay? This is all built around the scholarship program. This is gonna help you not just be a life insurance agent because let's face it, okay? It's very difficult to go out and sell a death benefit, okay? Especially when the insured isn't alive to see the benefits of the policy, right? Yes, we know that the breadwinner's family will be taken care of, but it's still a tough sale. We, we all know that, okay? But all of a sudden, when you're talking about living benefits, and you're talking about a policy with a tuition rewards program that will help and can help to pay for your child or grandchildren's education, all of a sudden, that's a whole new conversation, okay? And you become a superhero. You're not just selling a death benefit any longer. So this changes the game, folks. It's a huge plus. All of the carriers on the bottom have approved the Sage platform, okay? And you can take a look. Those are household names, very competitive products. Um, we're going to send out an email and we'll include everything after today's call so you can go back and make sure you're contracted. And of course, we can move forward and get you set up and enrolled in the tuition rewards platform. If you want any of the material co-branded, we can do that for you as well. Uh, just let us know and we will make sure that you have everything that you need to be successful with the platform. Okay, moving forward, uh, some more pushback that we received. The first year we rolled out the Sage Scholarship Platform, there was some confusion with agents when signing up a, a student in the, in the platform. So we made things very simple, okay? You literally send an email um, to your client that already purchased a qualifying product, they fill it out, takes minutes, send it back, and they are done uh, that simple. We have all of this information on our website, and again, we will include it uh, in our thank you email that you'll have before the end of today. Okay, we are going to roll into our feature presentation here. Um, we have Robert Savet from the Sage Tuition Rewards Program. He's going to take controls, and he's going to show you some of the ins and outs, do's and don'ts, and show you exactly why Sage is a hot commodity for moving forward into the future. Robert? Hey, thanks very much, Bill. Uh, appreciate it, and uh, uh, thank you, Joe. Uh, it's, it's great to be with you. It's great to, to see the number of attendees. It's, uh, it's impressive. Uh, yeah, Sage Scholars has been around since 1995, uh, and it's, uh, it's, a, it's a rewards program, and we're a way to, to get in front of prospects. Uh, we're a way to uh, improve relationships with existing clients, to upsell, reward, re retain, review, uh, and it, it's, a, it's a program that uh, the uh, high school seniors last year submitted 80, 80, nearly $81 million worth of reward points to our member colleges. So this is a, this is a program that's working. Uh, let me go a little off script right now and, and kind of give you the, you know, how, how this program came to be, because uh, I think one of the biggest things that you'll ever have to combat about us is, that, is it's too, uh, the perception that it's too good to be true. And, and this is uh, what we've taken advantage of. Uh, let's go back into the uh, 1990s. Uh, there's a small college in central Pennsylvania called Lebanon Valley College. New president comes on. His name is Dr. John Sinodinos. He's come from Johns Hopkins and F&M. And now he's finally, for the first time, president of a, of a college. And uh, he gets there and he sees that the enrollment is about 880 students. Campus is really built for the capacity uh, between 1,100 and 1,200. There's a lot of empty uh, rooms in the dorms, a lot of empty seats in the classrooms. Uh, big challenge. How do, you, how do you fill those seats? And uh, Dr. Sinodinos, uh, his cousin was Jimmy the Greek Snyder uh, out in Las Vegas. Uh, didn't really want people to know that very often. But uh, Dr. Sinodinos had the gambling gene. He uh, made an offer that... Uh, Nobody ever seen in higher education is if you're in the top 10% of your high school class, we'll give you one third off tuition, no questions asked. 
well, nobody ever heard of that. Uh, pretty campus. Uh, he certainly got uh, a lot of fathers to take their their, their daughters to, to take a look at Lebanon Valley, and it worked. Lebanon Valley's uh, enrollment today is about 1,600 students. He filled the seats. Uh, company uh, College went from uh, not being profitable to being uh, uh, certainly sustainable. Uh, and he not only filled the seats with you know, warm bodies, he got good students, students who've been the top 10% of their high school class. And the offer that he made, uh, a discount of 33% off the list price of tuition, is really the beginning of what's a trend in private college education called Merit Aid. Uh, right now, private colleges have a list price that often seems pretty high, but they have a price that you uh, actually pay, and it's really close to uh, the average at a, at a private college net tuition per year is in the $12,000 range. It's not what you think when you see a tuition that might be uh, uh, $25,000 or more, uh, but there are, there are discounts available, and the discounts are often given to the better applicants, and it's called Merit Aid. And uh, Dr. Jim Johnston, who founded our program, has really capitalized about that. We're trying to get, uh, we're trying to fill some seats. At, uh, right now, we have 390 private colleges. Uh, we've identified colleges that are affordable, uh, much more affordable than the public thinks. And uh, colleges is sort of strange. You apply to a college, and there's a list price, but you know, it's kind of like going to a car dealership. Uh, pretty much everywhere uh, that you don't really expect to pay list price when you buy a car. And when you, when you go to a college, when you attend a college, uh, it's a very custom financial aid offer. And uh, not that many people pay list price. Uh, that can be based either on because of financial uh, need as determined by the FAFSA form and other, other forms. When the, the second most popular is called the CSS Profile. Uh, but it's also because of the merit aid, and merit aid tends to be given, let's call it the top third of the incoming class, your best applicants, the, the applicants that the, the school really wants uh, are given discounts. I was very fortunate. Uh, both of my kids uh, received merit aid. Um, my daughter uh, went to a school in uh, upstate New York called Alfred University, and uh, uh, her, her offer was about one third off tuition, which is pretty significant. And my son went to the University of Rochester, and uh, on merit aid, it was a, uh, a total of thirty thousand dollars off the list price of tuition over the four years. Uh, both schools, by the way, are in the Sage program. So that's that's really what merit aid is about. The the top fifty uh, academically rated colleges in the U.S. do not give merit aid. So they're not in our program. So this is not a program that has Harvard or uh, uh, any of the Ivies or Stanford or Rice or Notre Dame or University of Chicago or Northwestern in it, Georgetown. Uh, they, you know, great schools. Uh, they can fill up their class without discounting. Everybody else in uh, uh, America that's a, that's a private college does do some form of discounting. So uh, uh, with... Get, getting back to the slides that you see on the screen, um, you know, first thing let's address is compliance. Uh, we've gone through the compliance process at uh, state departments of insurance and at uh, different carriers that uh, you know Bill uses. You know, Allianz has taken a close look at our program. So has National Life. Uh, so has uh, Kansas City Life. So have a number of others. And uh, what's what's uh, important to uh, a compliance department at a carrier or a state department of insurance is that the tuition discounts are provided by the participating colleges uh, to recruit more better students. The discounts are not provided by you, by financial advisors. They're not provided by Levinson. They're not provided by the carriers. They're not provided by Sage Scholars. So nobody is writing a check in the program. Uh, so your, your client is not receiving a check. What really is happening is that the college is providing a discount. It's very much like a car dealer providing a discount on a purchase of an automobile. Uh, to be compliant, uh, we ask you to provide rewards on past sales 
not just on new sales. If it's only on new sales, you've got inducement issues possibly. So, you know, give the rewards on past sales. It's it's good for uh, client relations. And, uh, you know, the prohibition is we're, we don't want our, uh, you know, our rewards program added as a value add on an inappropriate product. Uh, you can make our program available to a client's uh, immediate and extended family. So it's good for children, grandchildren, nieces, and nephews. We're at nearly 400 participating private colleges in 45 states. And the scholarships are guaranteed discounts, guaranteed off the list price of tuition. And it actually represents the minimum amount of scholarship that a student would receive at a participating college. So the maximum award is if somebody attends for four years, they can get one year of tuition free. Uh, that's, that's certainly great. Uh, the member colleges do provide merit aid. It's a discount to the better applicants of, of a freshman class. And uh, SAGE has been successful. At, uh, we have about uh, 65 financial affiliates and they're varied. Uh, we're not dependent on anybody. Uh, so the program is offered by uh, right now one state 529 plan, Pennsylvania. Uh, the program is offered by banks, credit unions, and we're finding a lot of success uh, with employers offering our product. Uh, we're founded in 1995. Uh, one of the uh, interesting things is that about private colleges is that the list price is higher, but also our the graduation rates, the four-year graduation rates at Sage schools at, right, compared to state schools. Uh, there's been a UCLA study. Um, yeah, it didn't have everybody. But it showed that 67% of private university students graduate in four years versus 28% of students at public universities. There's a real difference, uh, especially between the flagship uh, state schools and the uh, other state schools. You know, I, I wanted to do a little research uh, about Florida colleges because a lot of you might be from Florida. Uh, and you've got in Florida, for instance, you have some pretty good state schools. Uh, in terms of University of Florida, 67% of the new freshmen graduate in four years at Florida State at 61%. But if you look at the other state schools in Florida, um, you'll, you'll see a real difference. Uh, University of Central Florida is 40%. Uh, Florida International University and Florida Gulf Coast are 23%. Uh, University of North Florida, 26% of the freshmen graduate in four years. And Florida Atlantic, only 17% of the new freshmen graduate in four years. Uh, the, that compares to the private colleges in the state. Uh, three of them that participate in our program, uh, Rollins, 63% uh, of new freshmen graduate in four years. Eckert, 58% of new freshmen at Stetson, 56%. And the best college in the state in terms of graduation rate, we sure would like to have them in our program is University of Miami at uh, 68% of new freshmen graduate in four years. So uh, one of my, my big point there is that there's just a real, uh, you got to look at graduation rates. If you're a client, you don't want to pay tuition for a fifth year or a sixth year. And you want to make sure that uh, this, is a, this is a school where your, your student is going to graduate at all. SAGE stands for Savings and Growth for Education. Uh, we've got right now 530,000 students in the program who are earning tuition reward points or have them. And we're the largest uh, private college uh, savings related program in the country. You know, what's, what's in it for you? What's, what, what can you do with this program? Well, you can attract new clients. You can differentiate yourselves from uh, other agents. You can help uh, families reach a major goal, which is saving and preparing for college. Uh, we've got a lot of materials that uh, uh, help with uh, your college selection and funding for your uh, for your your clients and their students uh, grandparents really love our program they really uh, love the opportunity to help their grandchild uh, grandchildren uh, go to college you may be able to attract more dollars from existing clients and uh, you know retention is good customer loyalty is good so it's it's a three-way partnership with the tuition Colleges are trying to encourage uh, families to save and plan for higher education. Uh, the rewards are, are something that uh, helps students uh, consider and, and attend their college. Uh, you know, you're, you're providing it to, to, to clients, and that's certainly a great value add. 
And for families, they can earn scholarships, which are discounts off the full tuition, and they can gain access to outstanding college preparation and selection materials. There are a lot of, uh, a lot of clients in a lot of industries that uh, uh, you know, give, give tuition rewards. Uh, Levinson is unique in, in the insurance industry, certainly. Uh, cash value insurance is an excellent college savings vehicle. Uh, you can borrow off the cash value uh, of an insurance policy to help pay for college. And uh, it's, a, it's a tax-free event. And the, you know the rates to borrow off of an insurance policy that you hold uh, are substantially lower than getting a student loan. Uh, that's, that's a hot trend in uh, college. We have a network. Uh, I guess that's the best word. You know, the, the fancy word that we use is a consortium of colleges, universities, but uh, it's really a network. You, you think of phones and uh, you, you, you think of phone service. We have colleges that participate all the way from Maine to Hawaii. Uh, to look at this map, the white blue is where we have the most penetration, where we have the most colleges. Uh, this is a really good program if you're a Florida college to be in because you know that there are a lot of kids in the, the Northeast and the Midwest that want to attend a Florida college, but it's not really cost efficient to identify them. We give the colleges free use of our database of uh, you know, freshmen, sophomores, juniors, and seniors. Somebody's got to be in high school. You know, go recruit them. And uh, that's, that's, that's great if you're a Florida college to find kids that uh, are likely to be able to afford a private college, that uh, have indicated that they're interested in the private college. And uh, I guess last year, uh, you know, University of Tampa was the uh, uh, most active and most popular member of our uh, of our program for the students. And we had let's see, uh, 70, uh, 75 students in our program, have 75 seniors applied to the University of Tampa. So that's certainly impressive. Uh, we've got 400 colleges in the program. 80% of them are listed in U.S. News and World Report. Uh, when I, I joined the program in uh, 2007, and, and we've added in the last 11 years. Uh, so that's, you know, the, the list of member colleges is changing. It's improving all the time. And for the colleges, the major benefit is to recruit our students. The colleges sign contracts agreeing to provide students with tuition discounts that aren't based on financial need. And there are colleges in the country that don't discount tuition, and that includes most of your state schools other than athletic scholarships. And maybe the state school might give uh, some sort of uh, discount to kids in an honors program uh, to attract them. And there are 50 very selective private colleges that don't give non-need aid. And that's, okay, Duke is another one that I uh, missed when I covered that before. Somebody has an annuity, the formula is 5% a year, and you hold that annuity for four years, all of a sudden that's 20,000 points. It's a guaranteed discount of 5,000 per year for four years. That's, that's pretty good. Um, that's, you know, there's a, there's a maximum reward. It's whatever the List price of tuition is when a high school senior applies. Right now, the most expensive college in our program is Union College in upstate New York, and their tuition this year was fifty-three thousand and nineteen dollars. So that's the most that that's the biggest discount that somebody can currently get. But uh, our contracts with, with most of the colleges are indexed for inflation, so as tuition goes up, the maximum value of our program goes up. Uh, Let's talk about uh, Levinson and uh, what's, what, what rewards there are. Levinson clients can receive 5,000 first year points for a policy and 2,000 points for each year thereafter that the policy is in effect. Uh, the first year points are divided into pre-sale points and, uh, and points after the sale. So somebody can get 500 points just for, just for meeting with you. Uh, no purchase necessary and they get the other 4,500 points after a qualifying policy is sold. Um, the, the, there is a, a death benefit uh, limit and a, an annual premium limit. Each new sponsor gets 500 points. Uh, that's a client, we call a client a sponsor. 
and uh, you can get points also for uh, three referrals for an annual meeting. Uh, and each new student also gets 500 bonus points. And when the student gets into high school, uh, they can earn up to 3,000 more bonus points just for completing an academic profile. Uh, that's an 11th grade. And uh, you know, we're, we're carrier flexible. Whatever, whatever carrier that uh, Levinson works with has approved the program is uh, fine with us. You know your business better than we do. Uh, Levinson clients also receive annual points based on annuities. And, uh, at, and again, there's 3,000 points uh, that you might not be aware of for completing a student profile during 11th grade. You know, how do you enroll clients? Uh, you you pre-enroll a client online, uh, you need a client's email address. You need their policy number, you need the name of the carrier, there's a drop-down menu, and that enables Levinson to verify that a sale has actually been made. Sage will then send the client a welcome email. The client will click on a link, complete registration. Now, what does that entail? Username, password. Then the client adds students, and when the client logs in, and uh, that's, that triggers the enrollment bonus points. And after uh, enrollment, the clients designate how the tuition points are divided among the family members. We always suggest that uh, the points go to the oldest student first. If the oldest student uh, goes to uh, University of Florida, that not use the points, transfer the points to the next, uh, next youngest student in the family. Uh, maybe they'll use them. We, ju we just want the points used. We want to make it as easy as possible. You know, all family members are eligible for enrollment. Uh, one student can receive rewards from multiple clients. So uh, in terms of referrals, uh, you, you sell a policy to a parent. Well, now you've got a chance to sell a policy to a grandparent. That, that can mean more points for the grandchild, for the child. Uh, a client can sponsor multiple students. Enrollment can begin as early as birth. And if you, you do a, sell a policy to a young young couple, uh, they can enroll now. And uh, you know, have, down the road, is uh, if they have children or uh, uh, they, they had nieces and nephews, uh, you know, clients can accumulate the points now even if they don't have children. There is an enrollment deadline, uh, and that's right before the student starts 11th grade. Uh, the points go into the client's account, and the client then has to proactively transfer them to a student right before 12th grade. Uh, we, we send out a series of about seven emails to that email address. And once 12th grade starts, the uh, amount of reward points freezes, and uh, the student can't accumulate, accumulate any more points after uh, they're in 12th grade, but the client can still accumulate points. And again, if a, if a high school senior doesn't use the reward points, the points can typically be transferred to younger students in the family. You know, what is the fine print in the program? Uh, you know, tuition reward points are limited to undergraduate tuition at participating four-year private colleges, starting with the freshman year. The reward points must be submitted at time of application, and they're given solely as a reduction to the full tuition bill. Uh, the point, you know, the, they're not going to receive a check. It's not awarded in cash. Uh, the points represent discounts that are spread evenly over the four years of college, and there's a maximum of one year's tuition. And colleges can use the points as part of any financial aid package, so they represent a minimum scholarship that the student will receive. They might receive more, but they're not going to receive less. Compliance. Uh, always important to be in compliance, uh, you, you know, uh, being in the industry. Uh, you never want to receive a call from a client uh, and the client says, hey, my client has gone to one of the colleges on the list. Where's my check? Uh, boy, you sure don't want that. So there's wording in a two-page compliance PDF that uh, Bill and Joe will send out uh, to use in all your marketing. And uh, it keeps you compliant. It keeps you from having calls of uh, uh, send me a check for uh, for college uh, you know the the wording it gives you the exact wording to use that the tuition reward points represent a guaranteed minimum discount off the list price of tuition uh, the wording can be used in small type at the bottom of a page other um, prohibitions is that you can't use college logos on your uh, material or website if you don't have permission from the colleges 
Uh, you can't use the word credit. People tend to think of, oh yeah, it's this is this is like a credit. Well, actually, um, if you have a college credit, a, a college credit can cost about a thousand dollars. How did I arrive at that? Uh, say tuition, the list price is thirty thousand a year times four years, it's one hundred and twenty thousand uh, dollars, and somebody needs 120 credits to graduate, each credit is $1,000. You can't use the word credits. Uh, certainly state departments of insurance won't, won't like that. We don't want you posting a list of member of colleges because it changes. Uh, last year we added 21 colleges, so the, uh, the college list changed 21 times. Uh, probably changed a little more than that. There was There's one day a year where a college can withdraw. That's uh, uh, June 30th, July 1st. And also some colleges uh, change their name become a university. So uh, we just give you a link that you can uh, point to our, uh, our website if you have a website. And to ensure compliance, uh, you know, you send all marketing materials to Levinson uh, to send to us. And uh, our address for this is uh, marketing at Sage Scholars. And, you know, by being in compliance, it, it's for your advantage. It reduces your liability. Uh, how do investors access their account um, or clients? Uh, yeah, uh, every sponsor, every client has their own account. The clients come to our account to register, uh, complete registration, to add students, and it's available 24-7. 20, there are all sorts of uh, educational content and links. Uh, last year, we hired uh, a woman named Jenny Johnson, who was the former president of an organization known as PACAC, the Pennsylvania Association of College Admissions Counselors. Uh, that's, that's a group of high school guidance counselors. So she was the top one in Pennsylvania one year, and she's put together all sorts of new materials that uh, uh, your clients can access online and uh, really prepares kids for um, what do clients do when they're online. They add students. They transfer the rewards from their accounts to uh, students' accounts. They submit the rewards to colleges at time of application. Uh, we've made some changes uh, recently that uh, – a student can create a login and a student can submit their own rewards. So that's, that's always good. And um, the, uh, you know, if, if, the, if the high school senior doesn't go to one of our colleges, you can just reallocate the reward points. The, the client can reclaim them and use them for a younger a student in the family. And one of the things that's important to know is that the colleges don't receive any information on investors, clients. They just get the number of points of uh, the students who apply. So there's total privacy and um, it's a statement page. We make it pretty easy to, to apply, submit your points to a member school. Uh, it's, it's just a drop down, you know, it's, it's a list of colleges. There's a checkbox in front and boom, it's pretty easy. And the next, and overnight the, uh, the uh, points are submitted to, to each college. We usually have somebody in admissions and somebody in financial aid and uh, it's a pretty easy process. Uh, can a student apply to multiple colleges? Yes. The average last year was about 1.75 uh, colleges per student. There are educational resources online. We call them the 10-minute professor series. Uh, you know, one of the most popular is 10 ways to qualify for more or more aid, or what questions should you ask on a campus visit? And uh, that's about it. You know, you need an email address for the client. And if you have any uh, customer service uh, questions, uh, you know, send them on to uh, the, the, the good folks at Levinson. And if they can't answer them, they'll, they'll, they'll let us know. That's about it. Okay. That was uh, excellent, Robert. Thank you for that. Um, I'm going to also go over a, a few uh, pointers here uh, before Joe takes over. We're going to show you how, how to market uh, by utilizing some of our technology and, and getting the word uh, out there. Okay, This is a, a great generator uh, for, let's say, seminars, webinars. I'm going to mention a, a few things um, real quick. You know, I, I love to use this example. Like obviously, there's there's nothing else like this in the industry today, right? We all know that for a fact. So let's say, you know, me and Joe are, are both final expense agents. You know, we're working our lead programs and, you know, we both come across the same client, right? And, you know, I'm pitching uh, one company and uh, final expense is simply a, a whole life product, uh, low death benefit. 
and Joe's pitching another company, right? So we're both talking to the same client. We're, we're calling the client over and over, and we both have very similar companies, both A-rated. The premiums are neck and neck, okay? But let's say they like Joe a little bit more, okay? They relate to Joe better for whatever reason. No problem. But Bill is also bringing up the free scholarship program for their grandchildren, right? So here, the policies are neck and neck. Premium is neck and neck. Both great companies. They like Joe a little bit more. But the point is, I'm going to get the sale every single time. And, and you, you know, you scratch your head and say, why? If they like Joe better, why is Bill getting the sale? The reason why I'm getting the sale is because of the value add. Okay, we're both giving the same product, product versus product, neck and neck, but I'm giving this free scholarship, right, up to one year free tuition for little Johnny or little Susie or an unborn child, niece, nephew, any blood relative. They're going to buy the product from me every single time, okay, because of the value add. It's not costing them anything additional, there's no commission reduction to the agent. So now you can understand why we're so excited about this and why this is a win-win, okay? it's a, Once you get your arms around this, it's gonna help you tremendously. I don't care if you're selling over the phone with webinars or seminars, whatever the case is, you're gonna win every single time. So again, final expense, uh, annuities, okay? What a great add-on for annuity sales. Universal life, index universal life, okay, what a great tool. Here you have this cash accumulation every single year, right? Let's say a young professional buys a, an IUL. So you have your cash accumulation every single year, okay? Let's say 17 years later, little Johnny starts college. Now you literally have, let's say, $140,000 of cash that you can withdraw or take a, a loan against, right? We know that. That combined with the free scholarship program, you can literally pay for a full four-year tuition by buying an IUL or UL policy and still have the policy continue after Johnny graduates from any of our 390 colleges in the program. So there's so many ways that you can market and spin this. Okay, I just kind of uh, hope that you, you understand the, the concept here. Referrals, okay, huge door opener. Now, once your client now buys the policy from you, anyone that they refer, let's say uh, Susie down the street says, wow, this sounds great, I would like to know more. And you give Susie Bill Levinson's phone number, right? Bill's the agent. Susie calls me for a quote, then the referring student or policy owner gets 500 points, you, the agent, get a new sale. So it goes on and on and on. Annual policy reviews, okay? Once Susie, the policy holder, buys the policy from you, every year after, Susie's going to go back to you and get another 500 points, right, for, for the scholarship just for sitting down with you and conducting an annual policy review over the phone or in person. This keeps persistency numbers up. It keeps your name in front of clients, right? That's been the, the million dollar question. How do you keep your name out there? How do you stay in front of your clients? How do you keep policies on the books? This is the answer. So I, I just want everyone to, to kind of understand what the angle is here. It's, it, it's a huge, huge value add for any insurance or financial advisor out there in the field. Seminars, webinars, give everyone that comes to listen to you, right? All you have to do is bring up the program, talk a little bit about Sage. You can give everyone that comes a $500 gift card or, or credits for the tuition rewards program okay we have these little gift certificates that you fill out it's a five hundred dollar credit for tuition rewards it's a great value add seminars webinars even a meeting uh, over the phone or in person at starbucks whatever the case is it's a, a big huge door opener joe's going to show you what we did we incorporated the sage scholarship program into the new websites that you're going to be able to go out and market so your clients and prospects are going to see the information joe's also going to show you how you can start using agency automator and sending out e-blasts and different brochures 
all about the scholarship program. Joe? Yeah, thanks, Bill. So what you're looking at now is just a screenshot of kind of a sample website. Uh, we do have a scholarship tab available. And the whole point of that, like Bill said, is to drive traffic, show clients exactly how that scholarship platform works, and to generate leads. So the best part is they can learn about the scholarship platform. Uh, they can even fill out their information to learn more. You can advertise the free tuition reward points, and you instantly get an email with all that client's information. So now you have a lead to, to really follow up on. So the website really delivers a really great value for those clients to learn more. Uh, and nowadays with some of the stats we're looking at as far as clients wanting to uh, kind of learn things on their own, but also work with an advisor, the website is a must have. Uh, so then the kind of the common question that comes up is, well, if I'm getting people to the website or really first off, how do I get people to my website? And then what do I do once they fill out that information? So uh, we've built from the ground up our agency automator CRM platform stands for customer relationship management tool. So this platform not only allows you to find new prospects in your area uh, to drive traffic to the website, but also once you get that record, once you get that lead, what do you do with their information? How do you make sure that you're following up with them? You're keeping your name in front of them. You're doing the follow-ups that you need to do. Some of the statistics when it comes to selling policies and working with clients, most sales are made in about the eighth to 12th follow-up. So you have to have some sort of system in place to make sure that you're hitting those follow-ups and that's what Agency Automator does. So what you're looking at right now is a screenshot of the homepage. Uh, by the way, we do trainings on this platform two times a week. Uh, we'll get into that in a couple slides. But basically, this houses all of your prospect information, all of your client detail, their policy information, uh, even their policy anniversaries, conversion deadlines, uh, their birthdays. So you can automatically drip market on all of your clients for any of those life-changing events. So that's keeping your name in front of the client. That's part A. Part B is the built-in prospecting tool. Now, what you can do with Agency Automator is put in your zip code, uh, put in, let's say, a 15-mile radius. And in this example, uh, I looked for clients that were ages 30 to 50 that were homeowners. I can also set income, net worth. I can really dive into the demographics that I'm looking for. And this example gave me just over 3,200 local prospects that met that criteria. So once you build that list, uh, you actually can choose from about 2,000 different email marketing campaigns. We've completely built those out inside of the system, whether you want to market the scholarship platform or mortgage term insurance or long-term care or disability insurance. You basically pick which template you want to use. The best part about the platform is it tracks who opens that email, when they opened it, and it actually gives you not only their full contact information, including their phone number, of course, their email address, but their physical address as well. So now you have a lead you can follow up on, you can make that introduction. We also have a 2.0 version of Agency Automator, which includes a virtual assistant. So now you have someone working on your team that can make those phone calls, that can set up all these emails for you. It's built into that Agency Automator system. So we're really, really excited. There are agents that are using this platform and generating a ton of new business. In fact, at our annual Agent Expo that's coming up uh, next Friday, one of our agents in attendance is going to be sharing uh, some of his statistics and his experience on how he's used this agency automator platform to really be successful, uh, some of the sales metrics that are involved. So that's going to be some really, really valuable information uh, for all agents to be able to use this system and be as, a, as effective as possible to kind of find new leads and new prospects. So definitely a platform we're extremely excited about. Uh, like I mentioned, we have trainings every Tuesday and Thursday at 2 p.m. on Agency Automator. You can register for those right on carrylevinson.com. Now, just beneath that, you'll see there's a platform called Agency Automator Plus. And that's actually the same exact platform as Agency Automator, but it's designed for GAs and MGAs and agencies to go out and recruit active agents that are working in the industry. So instead of plugging in demographics for clients, you're plugging in demographics for active writing agents that you want to recruit to your agency. So it works the same exact way. Training for that is every Monday and Wednesday at 2 p.m. Eastern. I do want to mention next week, uh, Tuesday at 2 p.m., uh, we're actually having a complete demo on our new, brand new iGenius IUL sales software. Uh, it's really a tool that helps you take your IUL sales to the next level. It's a fully integrated platform to where you can run an IUL illustration and then create a customized report for the client, have presentations, have everything that really explains 
how that index universal life product works. Uh, that works especially well with the scholarship platform if you're planning to use index universal life and take distributions to pay for college. So I think that's a must have if you're selling IUL or even discussing IUL with your clients. Okay, good stuff, Joe. All right, so we're just about done here. Uh, we're going to end in about 30 seconds. Just a, a couple things I, I want to bring up. Uh, the new rule here as well is if you're activated in the SAGE program, okay, and you've been active for at least 12 months and you've never enrolled a student yet, uh, you were set on the deactive mode. So if you want to be activated again, just let us know. Um, after this training, you are now eligible. And then, of course, moving forward, okay, the same rule will apply. So obviously, if you're active, we want you using the program. There's no reason not to. So um, we, we're recording uh, this training as well. So uh, this could be used for any downline agents as well. If you want to copy, uh, let us know. It will also sit on our website uh, under the archived uh, training webinars. So that's, that's important. Also, um, those pins, those magnetic pins that we showed in the beginning, if you're coming to our expo, you'll have those at no charge. They're free. Um, if you're not going to make our expo next week, just let me know. As long as you're active uh, with a SAGE uh, qualifying carrier, we will mail a pin out to you. So, and we'll also send some brochures as well. Everyone on the call will get a thank you email. We'll include brochures and some other details uh, that we went over on today's call as well. Okay, so the expo is next Friday. I can't believe uh, the time has come. We have a record number of attendees. In fact, we're almost at 300 RSVPs, which to me is mind boggling. Just uh, two years ago, we had half of that. So we are killing it here at Levinson. And, and the reason why, I mean, there's no uh, secret recipe here. Um, it's, it's the value add, you know, it's anyone can go out and get a contract and, you know, these IMOs make the same old promise to everybody. We have the best service, best commissions, best products. Okay, which is all great, but the bottom line is if, if you don't have a way to get your foot in the door and share your story, if you don't have a website and lead programs, then a 280% contract is going to do you no good because you have no one to talk to and sell to. So we look at it as we're going to pay you, yes, the best commissions and give you the best service, but we're also going to give you tools and technology and lead programs that you can leverage to make more sales. That's the name of the game, right? We, we all know how that works. It's like having a, a 2000 horsepower car with no tires. Okay. You're going to spin. You're not going anywhere. You need the tires and the horsepower. So same thing goes with life insurance. It's not rocket science. So again, speaking of value at our Levinson Expo, these are our two keynote speakers, Neil Wilding. He's the creator of our new iGenius IUL sales software. Again, a game changer in the IUL space. On the right side, the infamous Joe Ross. Folks, bar none, he is the best life insurance trainer in the industry today. He's going to spend an hour with our agents live teaching you all kinds of new sales strategies and concepts and teach you how to get your foot in the door and close sales. Okay. That combined with our scholarship platform is a slam dunk. We have all kinds of cash incentive prizes, uh, tablets, different uh, technology accessories. We're giving away cash on the hour. Uh, we have a, a dinner the night before for our out of town guests. Um, we have uh, breakfast, lunch, snacks throughout the day on Friday. Again, it's free for all Levinson agents. I really hope to see you there. And we're also gonna do something a little neat uh, and different this year. One of our guest agents all the way from Texas is flying in and he's going to uh, stand up and, and present and, and show you how he is utilizing our technology and agency automator platform to make more sales. Okay, He's also one of our pilot agents in the lead program, so he's going to share his thoughts on that as well. So you're going to hear from a real street agent just like you and me who's out there in the trenches 
making it happen. I, I, I love that approach because, you know, let's face it, when, when you hear from a real agent who's out there on the phones and, and meeting at Starbucks, you know, it, it makes a big difference. It's someone we can all relate to. Okay, we're going to end with this. As always, our positive uh, Tuesday quote. We have these live quotes every Tuesday on our Facebook page. And, you know, the name of the game here is, yes, you need to have the great product, sales platforms, all of the value add necessary to make you a winner in the life insurance world, right? We know how that goes. Education, as we just saw, very, very important, okay? But let's be honest. I don't care if you graduated from Wharton or, or Harvard with an MBA. It doesn't matter if you're not in the right mindset, you don't have the right attitude and energy, you're not going to make any sales because no one wants to be around you, right? There's no secret sauce here, okay? Make sure day in, day out, you're in the right place. Do whatever you have to do to get there. Let's all stay positive. Have a good energy and always do the right thing when it comes to your clients, friends, family. So important. There's always a, a choice that you can make a, a left or right in the road and you always want to do the right thing. We're going to end with this. I'm in competition with no one, just trying to be a better person than I was yesterday. With that, thank you so much. Have a great week, a great weekend. We'll see you next week. Take care and good selling.